it's me, Danita Rose, and I want you guys to be like me and go against the flow. Um, what I've learned in all my years as uh, someone who has a lot of convictions is that if you follow your heart and you do what you know is right, um, God will always honor that. I've had many indecent proposals. It was a time when I had no money and I was starting to borrow money from my manager because I couldn't afford to pay salaries at home. And uh, this beer company asked me to be their calendar, the next big calendar model, and it was worth millions. <laughs> but that was the time that, um, you know, I was first growing in my convictions and I said, you know what, I'm going to challenge not just myself, but I'm going to challenge God in this. And I'm going to say, God, I'm going to say no to this, but I'm going to believe that you will provide for all my needs. So when I turned it down, actually a shampoo company came in, they, I became their longest running endorser. And not only did they counter the offer with something much bigger, but um, that endorsement went on for seven years. And I actually uh, had the opportunity to endorse a long sign alongside um, Catherine Zeta-Jones. For me, um, you know, in the beginning when you, when you start to do that, sometimes he grants those kind of things. Sometimes you don't see the quote unquote fruits of your labor. You know, you may turn down this project and maybe another project won't come in immediately. But I always know that more important than the rewards you get for doing good is you know that you're pleasing um, the guy upstairs. It's sort of like a hedge of protection over your life where not only do you experience protection, but you also experience the blessings of God um, in many different ways, most especially in the area of peace. There's always a peace and a joy and ironically a freedom that comes from obedience. So in, in my 35 years of um, knowing God, I've come to realize that obedience comes before understanding. You don't necessarily understand at the moment why you shouldn't do this or because the Bible says this, but um, when you obey that, then eventually the understanding will come later. I used to question things and then do what I wanted to do anyway, and then I'd learn the hard way. And then eventually I found out that, okay, it's better to just do it the right way the first time. So that's why I always go against the flow. If God tells me to do something, I do it. If the world tells me to do something and it's not what the God says, yeah, it's out of there. Again, this is me, Danita Rose, reminding you to go against the flow like me. <laughs>